Hey, Skeeter Robin. Man, this street bring back memories, man. It was around here somewhere where it all started. When Sam moved from Fresno to Long Beach, California, and got together some fellas in the garage. The house is near here somewhere. We on the street. This street is called Salt Lake. It's on the east side of Long Beach. And what happened was, Sam lived in Fresno, and he had created this dance style called Poppin' and Boogalooin'. He called us and told us about it, but we never seen it. And when, we, when he moved here, we came right here. Right here, it started right here. Now, it just started in a garage, and from this garage, it grew and spread to Long Beach, Linwood, Southgate, Compton, Los Angeles. A lot of people think popping started in Los Angeles. They always say from Los Angeles, but it started here. The culture grew, and now we wanted to grow even further. Go to Japan, Asia, to France, to Europe, all over. This is the starting point. Hey, that's where it started. Let's see, take it to the next level, all right? What's up? What's side, baby? Skeeter Rabbit. This house right here is where I, where I come from. Now, I wasn't born here. I was born in Dallas, but we went from Dallas to South Central, and from South Central, we came here to this house right here. This corner house was the house where everything jumped off. You know, uh, me and, and the styles of locking and popping and everything's happened right here at this house right here. So, uh, that's about, that's about how it happened and where it started, you know. From here, I went to Long Beach and hooked up with my cousin, Boogaloo Sam and Poppy Pete. And from here, I went from here to Long Beach and from Long Beach to Hollywood and from Hollywood to Japan, France, everywhere. It took popping all around the world with the electric boogaloos, you know. Just, ah, uh, uh, boom, breaking it out like that, baby. All right, that's it. Cool's cold. 16340 Coos Cove, Skeeter Rabbit, locale, back in the days. A little history for y'all for this video. You know how we do it. Yeah. Peace. Hey, I'm Skeeter Rabbit from the Electric Boogaloos. How you doing? I'm here to teach you some boogaloo moves. Some uh, simple moves and some advanced moves. You can learn it in 30 minutes. You'll do good. First off, I'm gonna show you the standard boogaloo roll. It's called the boogaloo roll or the old man. Both knees straight. You go to a diagonal angle and you just roll in the hip called a boogaloo roll. And if you travel with it, it's like roll, step, roll, step, step, roll, step, step. It's called boogaloo roll or old man. Old man, you kick with it. Kick, step, roll, roll, the old man, okay? That's uh, a move created by Sam when he seen an old man walking. I'll do it again slowly. The old man. Kick, step, roll, roll. I'll show you how it goes fast. It's called the old man. Uh, it starts from the kick, plant the foot, keep your left knee bent, then you roll at the hips. Once you roll, your shoulders switch with the shoulders. Kick, step, shoulder, switch. Switch, switch. All right, I'll do it fast. And in that, we use, in the old man, we use the boogaloo moves, which are hip and knee moves, shoulder and head moves. Knees, shoulders, head. 
That's into a walkout. Once again, knees, hip, shoulders, head. Knees, hip, shoulder, head. Right. Or you could go, now that's to the left, you could go right. Just like that. Once again. Ah! Hey, what's up? Skeeter Rabbit again. Check this out. This place right here. VIP Records, the real place where Electric Boogaloo's used to come and get all their records. It's the number one record shop in Long Beach area, east side of Long Beach. It's so famous, man. And check it out. Now this is the record shop. It kind of changed from way back when, 23 years ago. You know, it's new now. It's not. It's 2000 now. So it's totally different now. So we're gonna see if we can get Cal out here and tell you some history about, you know, the record shop and electric boogaloos and how we used to come up here and practice, you know, he used to let us in. Oh, there's Cal right there. What's up, Cal? What's up, what's up? Man? All right, baby. All right, yeah. All right. Now, this is, this is the owner right here. Remember, this 23-year rich history of the only record shop in this area, right? This is the east side. Poly High is right across the street. We used to stay on the street called Salt Lake, which is right down the street, before Martin Luther King was Martin Luther King back in the day. California. <laughs> yeah, California street. So so what's been going on, Kyle, man? Hey, you know, just staying in the community, yeah. still doing, you know, doing things and stuff, keeping the VIP tradition and name alive and stuff. Then look, 23 years ago, all right, this man has seen it all. He's seen it come and go. All the rappers, he got all kind of projects just coming out of this this location right here as well as this is the hottest spot in all Long Beach actually on this side of town from Compton all the way through all the rappers come here he has a, a wall of nothing but platinums and gold records of all the artists that comes and respect this place you know this is a very famous place and this is the the history of electric boogaloos when we first started dancing in 1979 78 coming up here practicing